Welcome to my channel. Join me as we explore the most beautiful and exquisite jewels worn by noble and royal families around the world. These are the jewels and tiaras that not only symbolizes power, wealth, and the pageantry, but also the family, history, love, and a sense of continuity. Please join me as I show you my favorite tiaras made from precious gems and stones collected by the royal families for centuries that adorns the heads of royal and noble ladies from past to present. Here, we will look at royal tiaras adorned with aquamarine stones. Unlike the other most popular three-color gems, the sapphires, rubies, and emeralds, jewels with aquamarine stones have also been sought after by royals. But what exactly is aquamarine? It is a member of a burial family of stones just like emeralds. Its name is derived from the Latin word aquamarina, meaning water of the sea. And the name is very apt as the stone's greenish hues are very reminiscent of the ocean. Most aquamarines are mined in a variety of locations around the world. The most famous is the one from Brazil. It is also being mined in Afghanistan, Pakistan, Russia, and Sri Lanka. But most aquamarines in the market today comes from Africa. The world's largest cat aquamarine gem is a Dom Pedro aquamarine, measuring 35 cm tall and by 10 cm wide and weighs 10,363 carats. Please join me as I reveal my top 10 favorite aquamarine royal tiaras. First on the list is the Brazilian aquamarine tiara, currently owned by Queen Elizabeth II of England. The aquamarine used in this tiara were a gift from the government of Brazil on the occasion of her accession to the British throne in 1953. Number two on the list is a Swedish aquamarine tiara from the royal family of Sweden. The tiara made of diamonds and five oval shaped aquamarine stones set in gold and platinum with a central stone prominently placed on the tiara. The shape is inspired from a classic Russian Kukushnik headpiece which flatters any royal ladies who wears it.
number three on the list is the Queen Victoria Eugenia's Aquamarine Tiara. Queen Victoria Eugenia was married to King Alfonso of Spain, and the tiara was one of the king's wedding gifts to her. The tiara contained seven aquamarine drops in briolet cuts hanging inside an interloping diamond pave circles. The tiara is currently owned by her great-granddaughter Sibylla. The number four on the list is the Dutch Aquamarine Tiara from the Royal Family of Netherlands. The tiara is made of seven violet cut aquamarines and diamonds set in platinum. It was a gift to Queen Juliana of the Netherlands from her parents on the occasion of her 21st birthday in 1930. The tiara is designed in the style of Art Deco. This tiara, like most of the other jewelry pieces, was put under the Orange Nassau family foundation, set up by Queen Juliana in 1960s. The jewels under the foundation can never be sold, thus keeping all the pieces from leaving the family. Fifth on the list, Sophie Countess of Wessex Aquamarine Tiara. Sophie debuted this tiara at the enthronement celebrations of Prince Albert II of Monaco in 2005. The stunning piece can be converted into a necklace, which features a jaw-dropping central aquamarine stone. The piece was reportedly made for Sophie by an English jewelry house, G. Collins & Sons. Number 6. The His Aquamarine Tiara The His Aquamarine Tiara is said to have belonged to Grand Duchess Elizabeth Fyodorovna of Russia, born Princess Elizabeth of His and Bahrain. The tiara is said to be designed by Farbage, which features a dainty festooned garland and delicate bows which hold up the five pear-shaped aquamarines set in diamonds. Number seven on this list is the Queen Elizabeth II Aquamarine Ribbon Tiara. Owned by the Queen Elizabeth II of England, this tiara with five oval-shaped aquamarine gems mounted on a diamond-encrusted ribbon setting was loaned to Sophie, Countess of Wessex by Her Majesty. 
It was first worn by the Countess of Wessex at a pre-wedding dinner of hereditary Grand Duke of Luxembourg back in 2012 October. Number 8. The Linear Aquamarine Tiara The tiara was made for Isabella Orsini on the occasion of her 2009 wedding to Prince Edouard de Lenier de la Tremont. The tiara features a distinct letter L, which stands for the family name de Lenier. Number 9. The Russian Aquamarine Kakushnik Tiara The tiara is made of lines and arches of diamonds and also showcases 16 graduated rectangular aquamarine stones set in platinum. Number 10. The Hesketh Aquamarine Tiara Owned by Christian Lady Hesketh, this Bell Epoch diamond and aquamarine tiara was sold at Sotheby's from their May 2007 sale. The tiara was made around 1910, fetched more than 98,000 US dollars. The Hesketh Aquamarine Tiara is designed as a series of graduated oval aquamarine clusters set with oval and hexagonal aquamarines. These are interposed with sprays of diamond myrtle leaves within meligrain borders of circular and rose cut diamonds. The Grand Duchess Alexandra of Mecklenburg-Schwerin Aquamarine Tiara. 